Hi, I'm David Blaisdell. Um, this is Thor. This is the, the big biodigester I've been excitingly waiting for. Uh, the smaller one didn't work out as good, which is all right. It used to be over there. Yeah, we'll slow the camera down. You're moving on. Right now. <laughs> Anyways, today is the day we're going to inoculate Thor and fill him with water. Um, upstate New York, nice and cold, like typical. Uh, nice April day. So I got a box of Ridex. This is a big old box of bacteria. Hopefully that'll... I'm going to inoculate with this. I don't want to do cow manure. It smells. I just don't want to deal with it. So if you want, my son will kind of do a, like a little panorama of this. Slowly, hopefully, he doesn't trip on the hose. Um, we're filling it as we speak. Let's come right in here. We got water going right now. We're, we're about here. So almost at the mark. I'll put in when I'm done with you guys. Actually, I'll I'll do it while I'm here. I'll put some in. I just PVC this together. Um, those ends here are loose. Just so if I have to take it apart, I can. This part here is holding tight. That way it doesn't move. I might even put like a support so it doesn't break off. For my my gas holder, what I'm going to do is I'm going to jump down. Is this big barrel right here? I'm going to put a barrel inside that barrel for a gas. Try that out. If that doesn't work, I'll go to a bag and get one of those bags. So, uh, as my son watches me, I'll, we'll do a little inoculating, see if this works. Hopefully, it doesn't blow off for him, so he might want to back up a little bit. Why don't you, uh, uh -uh. Why don't you get a better view? Come over here. You get a good view of that? No, it's good. So we're going to put the first stages in and of course I had to dump a little bit. This is a lot. <laughs> this is probably like four boxes. It says four months worth so hopefully I'll give it a, a good uh, good kickstart. TH Cohen says uh, use a lot so we're using a lot. Um, I'm strictly going to try once it's in, you know making gas. I'm gonna stay away from putting grass in it and stuff that's gonna really clog it up. I'm gonna try to keep really fine um, ground up stuff. Um, that Hopefully that'll work better. Careful though. Good. So, uh, hopefully um, it does its job uh, after, I'm sure this will be four or five weeks, if not longer, because of our nice warm weather we have here. Uh, I'm not really gonna worry about heating this too much because it just, it takes so much energy to heat these things. That, you know, I'll get my use out of it during the summertime. Um, during the wintertime, I'll drain off some water so it doesn't, you know, um, you know, so it doesn't expand and, and pop. So we'll see what we can do with this. Um, this will be my outlet. Um, if anybody wants to uh, comment on this up here, I mean, now that it's inoculating, hopefully, you know, I could always change this up. But it seems like these two big two inches going into... Uh, half inch will work because that's to me that'll be just constant gas a nice type you know flow um of course this is the feed that's the out um so you want back up get another view of this this is the outdoor boiler <laughs> over here so this uh, i always could uh you know run heat through their pecs but i kind of want to like like again i want to stay away from it. maybe during the winter time cold months i'll circle it with um straw bales you know, wet straw bales, and what that'll happen is it'll create heat over winter. So we'll, we'll see what happens. Uh, stay tuned. I will post as many videos as I can. Um, so definitely comment, please, on this stuff. Any, any help will, will, is more than appreciated. So uh, from upstate New York, this is David uh, with Thor. This is Thor, and see if Thor can do his job. Uh, thanks to everybody that uh, I've been watching thousands of your videos, um, you know, uh, shout out to TH because he's been, you know, fantastic and giving me heads up on stuff like this. So maybe one day we can get TH to come up to New York State and uh, or upstate New York and do a presentation on biogas. I think uh, I think the New Yorkers up here would uh, would love this kind of setup. So signing off for now.